Hi everyone, welcome to another Bearcat Sports Update. I'm Ralph Patterson with Lander women's soccer coach Chris Ayer. 12-3-1 on the season so far and I don't know how you think about that coach. I think that's pretty darn good. Girls are working hard. Uh, it's, it's been a very good year. Team chemistry is, is good um, and they're playing every day which is important. So they are, they're having a good year. And did you, would you take a 12-3-1 early or late summer when you're doing your preseason uh, practices? Would 12-3-1 would been okay for you at that point? Yeah, I think you always strive for perfection, but uh, you know, I, the ball bounces certain ways and things happen and you know, this is a good team. I think there's, I don't think we've played our best 90 minutes of soccer yet and uh, I think that's encouraging. So I think there's, there's still a lot more out there. I like that. Haven't played the best 90 minutes yet. That's, that's going to come 12-3-1 overall in the Peach Belt Conference, you're 5-3-1. So where does that put the Lady Bearcats right now? Well, we've, we've locked up the fourth seed. Uh, that's kind of where we are in terms of the yearly rankings. We will play UNC Pembroke on Saturday. Very, very good team. Going to be a very big test. And fortunately, we were able to host on Tuesday, which is November 1st, for the first round of the playoffs. And that's what you want to do. You want to be at home. You do. And it, hopefully it gives you a little bit of a home field advantage with the new, the new May complex. We've, we've really enjoyed playing there, and the facilities are fantastic. So the girls, the girls are comfortable. It's nice. Okay, 12-3-1 overall, 5-3-1 in the Peach Belt Conference. And I know in your 12 wins, you have 10 shutouts. I'm your basic sports crazo, and I know that if the other team doesn't score, you got a great chance at winning. Tell us about those 10 shutouts. Is that, is that your coaching philosophy? Do you build with defense first, or uh, how's it happening? Yeah, I think the, the girls have really bought in this year. They've, they've decided that we're going to defend and get behind the ball, but we're also going to play the way we know how to play and to try to attack for as much of the game as we possibly can. But the positions, they've done a good job in terms of, of what they're supposed to do defensively, and the goalkeeping has been very good, uh, been very well organized. Communication as a team has been good. Uh, you know, I think from the beginning of the year we, had, we adopted a policy that said, you know, we're going to try to get a little bit better every day in practice and in games, and I think that's been what we've been trying to do every time we've played, whether it's been on the practice field or in the game, and I think they've done a very good job of that and just kept the ball out of the goal. Okay, Coach, uh, big game at UNC Pembroke, and then a really, really important league playoff game on Tuesday, November 1st at the May Complex. So a lot to look forward to, and, and you're ranked in the region – but you you got to win to advance and with the ultimate goal of winning your conference tournament and getting into the NCAAs. I don't want to answer for you, but how do you get ready for this huge stretch? I, I think you come out every day and you practice strong and you just you keep working and, and doing what you do best. Um, we have a huge game on Saturday. You know our Peach Bowl Conference is is arguably the best conference in the country, and there's not a there's not any poor team that you play. Pembroke is very strong. We have to we have to go out and take care of our jobs and do our assignments correctly. Uh, then whoever we get in the, the first round of the playoffs, that's going to be a huge game too. Um, you know, we just hope that we can finish the season strong. We've started off well. We, you know, this is the second half of the year and really the second season, and we need to we need to do it what we do in the second season, the same way we have in the beginning of the first. Sounds good. Good luck. Thank you. Coming down the stretch for Coach Chris Ayer, I'm Ralph Patterson. Thanks for watching another award-winning Bearcat Sports Update. Our time's up. Thank you for your Goodbye, everybody.